The Ghost of Christmas Past. Hello everyone, I'm the Ghost of Christmas Pasty. I was born on Christmas Eve in the wild west of Cornwall. I was a beautiful large steak pasty, made of the finest skirt, tady, onion and turnip, dressed in a rich pastry, crimped by a pair of real Cornish hands. I was chosen by my mother to be left out as a meal for no other than Santa Claus himself. <laughs> <coughs> that very Christmas Eve, when the family went to bed and I was laying there all excited, waiting for the big man himself to come down the chimney and eat me up, that's when the evil pasty escaped from the fridge. climbed on top of me, and jumped up and down on me until all my gravy was gone. No! He then flushed my crust down the toilet, and then he waited for Santa to come along and eat him. I do not blame the evil pasty for what he did. In fact, I feel sorry for him. He had a very hard life. Nobody wanted to eat him. And people often poked fun at him, saying it wasn't a real pasty at all. So in the end, he was upset and neglected. He felt he had no choice but to murder me in cold gravy, or spend the rest of his life in the fridge, until eventually being given to the dog. He waited and waited and waited for Santa Claus to arrive so he could eat him up. When Santa Claus arrived, Santa was on a diet. So he never ate the pasty anyway, and just gave it to the dog. No! So remember everyone, while you're having a lovely time at home with your friends and family this Christmas, eating plenty of food, drinking plenty of beer, spare a thought for those cold and lonely pasties locked away in the fridge. Happy Christmas everyone!